Coins are flat, but they are not paper thin. The edge of the coin is its third side. There are some interesting things to observe there. There are primarily three types of edges on U.S. coins. The most common edges are smooth. Some coins have reeded edges or grooves around the edge. The third type is lettered edges, which can include mint marks, dates, additional information, and symbols, for example, stars. Here's a close-up view of the three predominant edge types for U.S. coins, smooth, reeded, and lettered. Smooth edges are the easiest to manufacture. Reeded edges were created to defend against merchants filing or clipping off a small part of a coin made of gold or silver. Reeded edges also discourage counterfeiting because they're difficult to create. Lettered edges allow some clutter to be moved from the coin's front and rear to the edge of the coin. Edge color can reveal deterioration of a coin's condition. A common example is that paper used to roll copper coins can leach into the edges of the coins, changing the color from red to red-brown and then brown over time. Many old rolls of uncirculated red coins look great until you examine the edges and see a brown edge there. It's forthright to display these coins in transparent tubes, allowing the edges to be visible. Many customers ask how to determine whether a coin is silver or copper nickel. It's easy if you take a look at the edge. There are some errors unique to the edge of coins. These are usually due to misplacement or misadjustment of the collar. The edge lettering can be missing altogether. This is usually found when the edge lettering is applied in a separate step from striking the obverse and reverse of the coin. Most of these errors don't bring much value, but the Jefferson dollar error should be well worth finding. In conclusion, there are three sides to a coin, and evaluating a coin should take all three into account. Examining the edge of a coin can reveal its metal content. Taking the time to view the coin from all sides will improve the worth of your evaluation. Thanks for watching.